And hello everyone and welcome back to NASCAR Heat 2. I'm your host, Nicodemus Kane. And we are back in the game. We're going to have some good fun today, I think. I don't know where in the hell we're going. Uh, let's find out. Why not? Next race. Um, oh, apparently it's Xfinity and it is at Charlotte. Didn't we just do a Charlotte race? I think we did. I think the last race we may have done was Charlotte and the trucks. Oh, well, anyways, let's go ahead and go. Let's check it out. While we are... While we're waiting <laughs> to write this down. If I can get this here. This is going to be kind of a uh, laid-back kind of video. I am uh, tired. I am tired as all get out. Let me tell you that much right now. It has been a hell of a week. Definitely been a hell of a week. So, of course, our new job started up. And we are in full swing. Trying to get that bad boy running. Of course, unfortunately, I don't have the setups pulled up either. Uh, for anyone that does not know... Yeah, there it is. For anyone that does not know what uh, what we do on this, we started out with uh, just playing it straight out of the box. In the second season, we pumped everything up um, one notch, like the difficulty and all that stuff. And then we started using setups from Knee Pit Gaming. Uh, of course, he does not have... <laughs> He does not have any setups uh, for Charlotte. He has very good setups, though. That's why I've been using his. His setups are just perfect. Just almost absolutely perfect for me. They they work well. They, they feel great. They don't feel loose or, you know, crazy or anything like that. So let me get into this. And we will go ahead and start fixing these around. Now, they may look a little weird. And I've said that several times. They just... I don't... Uh, especially whenever I go out looking for setups, because I don't really spend too much time doing setups myself, honestly. But whenever I go looking for setups, when I see, like, an entire column of setups that are, like, you know, one number, <laughs> I start wondering... I start wondering uh, the validity of those setups. But... Even though they look weird, they're still really, really good. So I would definitely suggest, like I said, uh, knee pit as in uh, the knee on your leg. Knee pit gaming on YouTube. Uh, not only does he do uh, very good setups, he does instructional videos on how to actually race the tracks. Which is a really, really awesome thing. So definitely uh, go check him out if you want to. But we're just going to run through this. I know this is this is the most exciting stuff you guys will ever see ever on YouTube is somebody actually going through and filling out their setups. But I don't ever do any of this stuff beforehand because I don't edit these. I I I personally think that sports games on YouTube, you know, they're just it's a thing that it just happens, you know? It, it's uh, We're kind of flying by the seat of our pants here. We're not really worried too much about uh, making these perfect. I'm not making these perfect. <laughs> I'll tell you that much right now. Uh, but, you know, I mean, I still like enjoy or I still like enjoying. Do you hear me? I still enjoy watching others uh, do, you know, sports videos like this. So, you know, I the main intention of, of this whole thing was to... Uh, make videos that I would like to watch. And again, if nobody likes this kind of stuff, then I'm sorry. I, you know, there's there are tons of guys. Um, I can name at least 10 guys right now that I have found over the past couple months that have been doing uh, NASCAR Heat 2 uh, playthroughs. Career mode playthroughs that are really, really good. I didn't want that one. I want that one. So, I have also been doing a... Oh, shit. I have been doing a... Uh, a non-recorded playthrough of... Uh, oh, he hit me. Damn it. But whoa, I have whoa. been... 
I've been kind of playing uh, Dirty Daytona in my free time. That game is so good. I just, it's just, it's amazing how good that game is. Oh, that's nice. Just, just push me right up in a wall. That's good. Thanks for that, dude. But I've been playing that, and I am still kind of playing NASCAR Thunder 2003. Uh, I actually found a piece of paper. I, I keep, I keep damn near everything I have. Um, so I keep all of the notes and cheats and whatnot that I've ever made for any video game ever for the past 20-something years. So I have the shoe box. Oh, shit. That was, that was me being it. Come on now. There we go. But, uh, no, 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 I'm not doing that. So I went digging through this, this shoe box because you can't find Dirt to Daytona setups online. They just don't exist, and I don't know why. Well, I mean, I kind of think I know why. I think that they existed at one point in time, but all the websites that they existed on are obsolete now. So they have been lost to the lost to the black void that is the internet, which kind of sucks. But you know, it it is what it is. Progress tends to kill things that uh, nobody pays attention to. So I said, well, maybe it's in my uh, shoebox full of notes. You know, you just never know. So I went looking, and I didn't find any Dirt to Daytona setups, but I did find one sheet. Uh, it actually says on the bottom, page one of two, uh, it was one sheet of NASCAR 2003 setups. And I remember the page. It's old. Uh, it's, it's old. It's, it's brown. It's nasty. And uh, I said, well, you know, okay, maybe these will be good. I, I don't remember where I got them from. There's no, like, notes on them or anything that tells me, you know, who made them. I, it looks like I copied and pasted, pasted them into a notepad and then just printed out the page. So I have no idea where they came from at all, and I can't look them up anymore. God, this setup is amazing. It's like I said, Knee Pit Gaming. His setups are incredible. This It feels good. I don't feel like I'm losing control of the car. I don't, I don't feel like I'm... I'm uh, killing myself to go any faster or slower than I am, and if I if I feel like I'm getting in trouble, all I gotta do is lift. That's good enough, though. We we have a we have a good car going here. But anyways, um, I tried these setups, and I don't know where they came from. And man, they are incredible inside of that game. So I said, you know what? I'm gonna start my career over. And uh, I'm going to use these setups just to see what happened. And, you know, sure enough, they are really good setups uh, for a career mode. I think uh, whoever made them was probably using them in the uh, career mode and was saying, you know, this was... There was a, a, a finished in uh, a line on each one of these setups, you know, finished in 10th, finished in 15th, one of those kinds of types of things. So I think that's probably what that was, is it's where they finished in career mode using this setup. And, oh man, they're really, really good. So I have been, uh, I restarted my 2003 playthrough, and, uh, you know, I'm going through that. If it's any good, I will come back into it again and record it because there are several other guys right now that are doing 2003 uh, only because I, I, you know, it's such a difficult game so it's understandable for people to want to uh, want to do that game and watch that game and I, I have no problem going back into it at all and playing it it's, I've been having a lot of fun with it but I definitely want to do uh, Dirt to Daytona again oh my god I've been having so much fun with that game all right, here we go. Oh, oh. Go, 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 go. How many laps? 14 laps? Inside, inside. All right. So, of course, 14 laps, we're not going to have to pick. Inside, it's still there. And we're going to find out just how good this setup actually is. Man. It is so, it is so weird going from, oh, uh, like, 2003 back up to this. Because it's like the cars... <laughs> It, the cars feel there. so different, and everything looks so much bigger than it should. Stay right there. But well, the cars look bigger than they should. I mean, I, this is probably the size that they're supposed to be. Oh, shit. Damn it. 
Really? Well, there we go. I'm 39th place. That's, that's wonderful. That's... Uh... But inside of uh, inside of 2003, the, the cars feel so small. The the track feels so big. You know, you're you're going around it, and it feels like you've got you know forever and a day <laughs> to be able to go from one side of the track to the other. But on this. It's like the cars are huge. It feels like you're taking up the whole track. And I know you're not, you know. I know, I know I can see it right here that, you know, it's not that big, really. But it just feels like it. Let's put it that way. All right, let's see if we can get some freaking... get some freaking spaces back. This is nuts. Now this does feel a little loose. Um, I think it only feels loose because it's it's so damn fast. It feels like I'm it feels like I'm a rocket ship. It really does. It, it feels like I'm just. It feels like I'm going so fast I can't control it. And it is bouncing a lot. I can tell you that right now. But because he doesn't have, uh, or because Knee Pit Gaming does not have a Charlotte setup, we were we are using the Atlanta setup because this track and Atlanta are very similar. All clear, all clear. Damn, I'm doing all right. Look at this. With with nine laps left to go. I don't know. What do you guys say? Ooh, get off the wall. I don't know. I think we're doing all right. If I can get back up speed. Then I I am having to lift slightly because it just it feels like the car just wants to go right up the track. Right up the track. Right up into the wall. All clear. Ooh. -hoo. Passing on the outside. Oh my god. But it doesn't feel like I'm losing control of the car. It, it, as soon as the car starts sliding up, all I gotta do is just let off that gas and I'm able to control it fairly well. So these setups are amazing. And just just I can't uh, I can't thank him enough for uh, posting these up. These are incredible. Of course, I did also say that uh, I wanted to see what would happen if you were to take these setups into, uh, like, some of the online races. What would happen if you did that? I definitely think that would be something interesting to see. God, man, those bumps right there at the beginning of Turn 1 are just stupid. Oh, look how fast we're going. sense of speed in this game. I mean, we, in the trucks, I think the top speed you can get in the trucks is, what, 170 miles an hour, and it feels like you're barely even moving at all. But in these cars, man, it, it's just, it's getting faster and faster and faster. And I haven't even run, like, the, uh, like the Cup Series cars. I haven't done anything in a Cup Series car, so I don't know just how fast this game can get you. It's a uh, good drive off here. Clear out loud. Come on. Come on. Five more times. Finish it off. Easy, easy. I think we're three wide. Oh. Clear low, stay low. Still a car out there. No, we Clear weren't three. I thought we were three wide. I guess that one dropped back. I don't know who that is back there. Oh, come the hell on. Oh, what? You've got to be shitting me. And there are no cautions either. Uh, we have not turned the cautions on because if you go one... We're back in last place again. 
if you go one click off of uh, default settings, all it does is turn black flag on. It doesn't turn the caution flag on. Damn it. Damn it. Man, we were doing so good, too. And who was that? That Annette? He decided that he wanted to come right down into me while I was trying to pass him in the inside. What the hell, man? Sometimes this game just... I don't know, man. Sometimes the AI is just dumb as dirt. And I think we are, we are on uh, hard difficulty. We're not on legend difficulty yet. Alright. <laughs> we, we only got two more laps. Damn it. Do it. Steady. Clear. Get around this. If I can get up to those three, I could probably get three more places. This sucks, though, man. This absolutely sucks. Of course, I didn't even look to see uh, what uh, star car this was either. I, I didn't even think about looking. Come on, guys. You're going to have to let me through. Oh, nice. Come on, baby. Well, that's all you're going to get. Damn it. That's all you're going to get. That sucks. Man... That really sucks. I beat the hell out of that car, too. <laughs> I don't know what place were we in before they hit me. I don't remember. I think it was top, well, top 15, maybe. I don't know. That sucks. I got the fastest lap on that, though. Man, these setups, they're just brutal. I'm just saying, these setups are absolutely brutal. Uh, you missed out on getting that top 25. Yeah, no shit. But don't feel bad. Charlotte's a tough track. Not really, but okay. Keep working hard and you'll get there. Yeah, right. What are we at next? We're back into trucks. Yay. Oh, okay. So we got to pick an incentive. Um, In the trucks? We can win races. I don't, I don't want to... Oh, man. Should we go for a challenging or a normal? Qualify top 10. Uh, that's going to be a problem. Top 10s we could do. Leading a lap, maybe, but but qualifying top 10s? Oh. Because I'm not using qualifying setups. I'm using race setups. I can hit this one more than I can hit that one. Two wins and five top fives in the next five races. Dover, eh, Texas, uh, I can do Texas. Gateway, eh, Iowa. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's try this. All right, so now we are at Dover. All right, so let's do this at Dover. Let's get it done. Let me write it down before I forget. See, I write it down in my little book. That way I don't have to go fishing for it later. Now, I don't know if we already have a... Uh, have the setup for this in career or not. Okay, here we go. He does have Dover setups, though. At least. So at least we can use that. Nope, something went wrong. 
apparently YouTube says something went wrong. I'm looking at my phone. Sorry, guys. I know. It's ridiculous. Alright, so let's do this. No, I need to put this here, put that there. God, I'm all over the place. I'm sorry, guys. Like I said, I'm all over the place today. It's like my brain just is not working. I have been working so hard. And, of course, then the uh, one day that I get off, all my free time goes into making these videos for you people. Because I love you guys so much. I love doing this so much. We uh, were talking about it at work, actually. Um, one of the guys was asking me about uh, about why I do it. If if all I do is, you know, I'll work, I'll work eight hours a day, and then I'll come home and spend another, you know, three hours on a computer doing this. If I'm not getting paid for it. And I was like, man, I have fun with it, you know. It's, I, I, I get to play games. <laughs> that's, that's enough. This gives me a reason to be able to, to sit down and, and play all the games I want to play. What's that, 27? And, uh, you know, it, sooner or later it's going to lead to something. I, I think people are starting to catch on. I, I've, uh. I've been watching the the view numbers and the uh, the amount of minutes that people have been watching, and they've been going up, which has been surprising me. So I am like, you know, somebody somewhere is starting to uh, they're starting to come back. So you know, if you're one of the ones that have watched one of my other videos and then decided to come back and watch this tomfoolery, then I say thank you very much because. You know, I I like sharing. I like sharing my gaming and my stories with other people. I really don't have too many uh, real life friends. Oh, I know that's sad, <laughs> but I really don't. Uh, I um, I'm not one to to go out and you know actively hunt out new friends. So you know, being able to uh, talk to people here, it's all good fun. All right, now this was, or this is a setup for the uh, Cup Series. I didn't see where he had this on the trucks, so I don't know if this is going to be, and if it's going to transfer down, I don't know. We're going to find out. I can say it feels pretty good so far, so we're going to have to find out. It does feel good so far. That was really good, actually. And I'm just lifting. I'm, I wonder if I even have to lift. <clears throat> this is going to be bad. No, I'm going to have to lift. <laughs> I'm going to have to lift. <laughs> Shit. But it feels tight. It feels tight. It feels good. And it looks like it's pretty fast, too. So, I mean, we've got that going for us, at least. And I can slightly lift going around the corners, which is nice. So, yeah, this looks good. This is, uh... This would be all right. This would be all right, all right, all right. I am taking a little bit high of a line. I'm gonna stop doing that. Yeah, that's good. All right. All right, so let's go ahead and qualify this bad boy, see what happens. Green flag, one time around. Go, 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 And it was making me mad uh, as I was playing NASCAR Thunder 2003. 
that uh, I kept saying, man, I just, I can't do what I want to do in these cars because this controller just doesn't feel right, you know? And I, 13th. <sighs> Shit. So much for those top 10 uh, qualifiers, huh? But, um, Ready. Steady. Superior 6. But I kept saying, that it's just that the controller just doesn't feel right. You know, it's really hard to move the sticks around. It's really hard to uh, get anything to work the way I want it to work. And so I rearranged everything in my room again. Uh, all my consoles. And I went through a box of, of wires that I had. Because uh, right now I'm trying to recover a couple hard drives. I've had some hard drives that kind of failed a long time ago, and now it's like I want them back. So I'm kind of I'm trying to recover them. Uh, one of them has a lot of stuff that I've had for years and years and years, so I have to get that information back. Actually, one of them, believe it or not, uh, this is topical <laughs> to what we're doing, is um, it has every NASCAR sim racing file that I ever made. Uh, not only ever made, but ever downloaded. I downloaded a ton of stuff from uh, Black Hole Motorsports. Anybody know that one? Uh, if you even remotely know what Black Hole Motorsports was, just go ahead and stop the video now and give it a like. Because that was the place to go for just damn near everything racing back in the day. Uh, but uh, it, this hard drive has all that stuff on it from NASCAR Sim Racing, and I said I need to recover that because it's going to be something that we do eventually, I'm sure, because NASCAR Sim Racing, I, I was I was inside of that game for years upon years upon years, and uh, I have been wanting to uh, pull it back out and get back into it, but everything I had ever done and everything I ever downloaded, it's it's on that hard drive. I can't get it back. So I'm trying to recover them. I'm actually recovering them right now. I've got two computers working on two different hard drives. And uh, so hopefully we'll get that done. And uh, we'll see what happens with that. But I don't remember what I was talking about originally. I don't remember what led me to... Uh... Oh, I was moving stuff around. Oh, the controller. Yeah, so I was moving stuff around and I got into that box. I know, my uh, my stories are all over the place. If you don't know that by now, you ain't been watching. So I found this other controller that I totally forgot I had that I bought for the PlayStation 2. That uh, it's one of the uh, the clear ones. This is not really clear. It's more like a gray kind of clear. I don't know how to describe it. But um, it was my main controller. I totally forgot that I had it. I pulled that thing out and I messed around with the sticks and I said, this is my controller. That's what was wrong with the other, with the other uh, controller I was using. It was the sticks are nasty. I think I need to open them up and clean them out because... Man, the, my new one, the sticks move just fine. It feels good. And so when you, uh, wh when I talk about having, you know, the controller was broken while I was trying to play uh, 2003 before, I meant it. <laughs> the controller was broken. <laughs> one of the few times where you can actually say, you know, uh, the controller was, was absolutely the one thing that was making me play like crap because with the new controller it feels so different. Oh man, it's, it's, it's a completely different thing. It's a whole new game! Yeah, no, it was... It's nice to actually have a decent controller that actually works, feels good, and I'm doing a lot better in the game. I think... I almost think maybe that was part of the biggest problem I had. But I don't know. I don't know, but but there were, the difference was absolutely night and day. Guaranteed night and day.
But I'm still thinking about if we, uh, whenever we get done recording this, or if we happen to have some other slot open up in between uh, as we go through the Final Fantasy games, um, I will totally be down to doing uh, NASCAR Thunder 2003 playthrough. I have no problem with that. I definitely, uh, one of these days before I die, <laughs> I want to do a Dirt to Daytona playthrough. Because I never actually got past the, uh, I never got past the trucks in that game. Uh, it was, it was one of those, those things where, you know, the, the dirt cars were awesome. The, uh, the modifieds were really cool. Uh, the trucks were nice, but I always had a problem with, they just, they were just too damn slippery. The whole game, uh, the bigger, you know, the bigger series, the, they just, they just felt too slippery, and it just, they never drove right for me, and so I just kind of gave up on them. So I never got past the trucks in that series. I would like to see what uh, going through the whole game is like. And of course, I've been playing it on. I've been playing it on uh, legendary difficulty, so it has definitely been, uh, it's been a slow slow grinding trip but it has been fun as hell and you can you can see the uh, progression as you go you know i'm just i'm getting better and better it's been really fun let's well, see look at that there's your win because we knew it was going to be a win let's be honest we did there was there was no that no way this wasn't going to be a win <laughs> especially with these setups there's no way this isn't going to be a win that sucks that my name isn't on the back of that truck, but I did steal the truck from somebody else, let's be honest. So I get the fastest lap, I get the most laps led, I didn't get the worst to first, or whatever it's called, on the move. I did get the on the move, wow. Okay, is there anything else? Tough break? I will never get the tough break. <laughs> Alright, so we're good with that. So those are my two races for the day. So we're going to go ahead and stop it there. Where are we going to next? Doop. Oh. Texas in the trucks. Oh, yes. Texas. I love Texas. One of my, uh, one of my top five tracks. So that's going to be a fun time. So, with that being said, thank you guys very much for coming out and checking this crazy, nutty nonsense out with me. This has been NASCAR Heat 2 on the PlayStation 4. I've been Nicodemus Kane. Thank you guys so much for watching this. Um, again, if you happen to have been a racing uh, gamer back in 2005 2006 somewhere around there even up to I think they closed it down in 2009 Black Hole Racing or Black Hole Motorsports if you remember that like I said leave a comment or leave a comment leave a like let me know let, let me know what you played cuz I that was for everything I remember R Factor was in there and um there was a lot of guys that were still playing uh, NASCAR racing 2003, I think it was. God, the mods for that game. Holy crap. I still have a copy. Uh, it's it's not like a full copy, but it's still a copy uh, floating around here somewhere. I know I do. But just... Oh, man. It's, it's one of those resources I wish were still around, but there's just not people... <laughs> there's just not people racing games anymore. It's just... It's sad. I mean, there are people, but it's just not... It's not like it was. Let's put it that way. Anyways, guys, like, comment, and subscribe, or don't. And until Texas, I wish you all well in all your future endeavors. And I hope that the world lasts for you. God bless. Take care. And keep your eyes on the road and your hands upon the wheel. Later.